Hello everyone and welcome to trying to get the Scram Spike to the moon in Kerbal Space Program 1.12. We are in the save where I do have the International Space Station around the moon. Let me double check that. So the challenge is to try to get the Scram Spike over there. Now in order to do that we're going to need to refuel it in orbit first and then it will have to try and go over there and rendezvous with the ISS in that orbit. Uh, we are not going to be using the Monument Launcher for this, we're going to try and do it a little bit more legitimately, but can we is the question. Now, the Scram Spike has Aerospike engines, uh, as far as its rocket engines are concerned, and that's all we're going to be using for the trip. So let's just take a look and see how much Delta V it has in just that mode, which is still pretty substantial, probably. Seems like 5,100. It seems like it's going to need about 170 tons of fuel, which is a lot. And it's about 348,000... I better just jot this down. Liters of hydrogen and 128,000 liters of oxygen. So that's beyond the capacity of SLS or, or Starship. Okay, well that will basically be fully refueling the Scram Spike. Okay, so we need to carry 175 tons to orbit. That probably means we're expending this whole thing. Alright, ignition. Should have, well we clearly don't have water, so... Off we go. We're going to hot stage. <laughs> so, we will have engine group controller for these three. Then I can throw all them down separately. Okay, ignition. Or, uh, and retract things. And launch. I forgot to take those two grid fins off. Okay, well... Oh, well, who cares? <laughs> I didn't get around to doing all the complicated things. Now this, I haven't used in a bit. Scramjet low and then there's a scramjet high. Scramjet high is optimal at Mach 10.7. All right, well, let's see. Okay, here we go. Come on. Well, we have to line up with our target. Okay, on we go. So, for those who haven't seen the space plane before, this is it. Crew only, no cargo. Okay, now we have to be careful because the scramjet likes to overheat. Keep it up. Okay, opening the big intake. And... Ignition.
Uh, come on, come on. I didn't do that perfectly well here. Okay, let me try the next mode on the scramjet aerospike. Uh, don't know if there's the safe time to do it, but well, we're accelerating. And that's a lot less thrust, though. Probably don't want to be going down like this. <laughs> This is definitely not going ideally well here. Yeah, I didn't do that right. Well, I'm gonna ignite the rocket engines. Anyway, that could be done better, but we still have a chance to get to orbit. Okay, so it's in front of us. Oh, we should probably boost a little bit further. We don't really want to meet up here, per se. Okay, this is getting dire. Oh, it's in residual territory. Okay, well, we don't have any propellant left. So, just hold steady. I'll take it. <laughs> okay, well, we have a rendezvous. Uh-oh, that direction doesn't work. Uh-oh. Hmm. Just th turning gives us a lot of residual thrust we don't need to because of the thrust replacement. Well, it's right there, but we've got all sorts of control problems. Yeah, the, the vector wanders quite a lot because of the placement of our RCS in ways that I really don't need it to. See, right now, because of all the other ones, they're pushing us. We're suddenly going a lot faster than we should be. We need the tank to come out of the bay. <laughs> uh, we can't leave the tank in the bay. We, we need a tank to be able to rendezvous on its own. Not, not, so let, let's, um, we're gonna dispose of this puppy. <laughs> this doesn't have enough fuel to do anything else right now. Well, it will be able to get back into the atmosphere and perish, but anyway, we won't talk about that. Let's send something else up to rendezvous with the scram spike. Nominally, this will be a hydrogen tank and that will be the oxygen tank, but really I'm going to put the propellants in both. Something like that. Okay, ignition. Go. No, oh, too too late. I was too late. What? Whatever. Well, I guess we're catching up.
Okay. <laughs> okay, now we have limited electric charge. Uh, you know what? Uh, we're gonna hit the plane like this. Definitely docking blind here. It's in an instrument docking. Can barely see ghostly outline of things. Okay, we somehow docked. Oh no no no! Let's not do that. Wait, no ignitions remaining. I'm gonna have to fix that, aren't I? Uh, originally the engines had five, which we didn't use all of, by the way, just for the record. Somehow when I used my throttle it took out a whole bunch of ignitions, that's all. So I decided to increase it to 12 ignitions for those aerospikes and gave them the extra seven. So it looks like we have 4,800 meters per second, which can get us to the moon and capture around the moon and we can transfer back potentially, but after that, we're in aerobrake situation, which is not great. But we'll think about that eventually. For now, let's just get over there and dock with the station and then see how much we need. Hmm. I don't like where my periapsis is like this, though. But if we tilt our orbit, that periapsis could end up over here, which would be nice. So maybe I'll just leave it like this. Well, we'll let the air spikes turn us. This has some other Delta V. I guess that's uh, jet engines still. Well, not exactly where I wanted it. There's some Kerbals inside, apparently. Because food and oxygen are being consumed. I don't know where they are, though. <laughs> where, where are the Kerbals? Okay, well, that's as good as we can do that. Don't know why it makes that extra sound. It's a stockish sound, so something went wrong there. Maybe we shouldn't. It's a little bit tough to figure out the right order of operations here. Oh, we definitely don't have enough to come back like this. There it is! Oh, uh, just on time with the music, too. Don't ram the S4B stage. Oh no, S2 stage. NASA would not like these maneuvers. I think I wanted it to be the other way around actually, but whatever. It's fine. Oh. Oh, we had the some other thing set as target, that's why. No no. Ah. Oh the roll is different. No, be careful. <laughs> 